Welcome to Electron Line. Here we have a very special situation. You need to recognize this as the sum of cubes. With other words, we can rewrite this as the quantity x cubed plus the quantity 3y cubed. So it's the sum of cubes. And whenever we have the sum of cubes, it can be factored as follows. a cubed plus b cubed. This can be written as the quantity a plus b times a squared minus ab plus b squared. Likewise, if we had, for example, the difference of cubes, a cubed minus b cubed, that would be written as a minus b times the quantity a squared plus ab plus b squared. So in the same token, when we see something like this, we have to recognize it like this, and we can solve it like that. Solve it meaning we can factor it like this. So this is equal to, since it's the sum of cubes, is a plus b. a is x, b is 3y, so this becomes x plus 3y. So this would be a plus b, b being 3y, times a squared, in this case a is x, so that's x squared, minus a times b, x times 3y, so x times 3y, and then finally, plus b squared, and since b is 3y, that would be 3y squared. I wrote it like this so you can see that the equation of the form is exactly the same. Now we simplify this, and now this can be written as the quantity x plus 3y times x squared minus 3xy, because we like to write it number x and y, and then plus 9y squared. And this is what we call the factored form of the sum of these two cubes. And that's how it's done.